Well, howdy diddly dandy there, chums, tis I, Captain of the Steves, and I'm back inside of Towers of Agaspa. Now, I'm heading over to my mining town, I'm already there, and I'm at the village board. Let's have a quick look, see, shall we? Now, we have a task here to destroy withered blobs, and I've done 11 of 20. I'm not so sure what they mean by withered blobs, unless they mean the tumours on this, or like, withered bases. So... I'm going to head on out and see if that actually counts as being a withered blob by taking out one of the tumours or two. All right, well, I'll let you know when I get to one. All right, well, I've arrived at one. Now, I need to get my bone sword equipped. Now, I'm thinking just run at it and burst the blobs on it as quickly as possible because some of these withered bad guys are a little bit tough, even now. I mean, I can try and take out him. Uh-oh, there's a hand. The hands are virtually... They're my nemesis. I hate fighting the hands. Right, let's just get on here. Let's climb on up. Climb, 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 you freaking idiot! I'm dead. I'm freaking dead. Freaking dead. Right, chums, well, I'm back there. Now I'm just going to let my stamina rebuild. I'm going to run at the tree and get on the freaking thing. Let's get on it. Let's climb on up, past where the hand can get me. Okay, this is this is a little bit dodgy, because the actual pus that I need to get to is around this opposite side. Right, just stand here and wait for me to get my health back. Oh, my days. There we go. Right, so we're getting rid of some sort of tumour right now. Right, well, I think what I've got left to go is the core. So let's do the core. There we go. Now you still don't get like a a time bar for the core. It's still a little bit buggy. So as long as you light up like a freaking disco, I think you're good. That's it. We've got rid of it all. Okay, we can have that. We've got some withered tar. Nice. I'm trying to make the full withered armor set. Now, I've got the actual chest piece. I've got the boots. But what I don't got is the leggings. So I've got pretty good withered protection. You wouldn't you wouldn't think it. You know, because I get hit once, I'm freaking dead by those hands still. But anyway, let's head back to town and let's see if that classes as withered blobs. Otherwise, I don't know what a blinking withered blob is. And I just bounced off that rock. I thought I could climb it. My town's just at the opposite side. Anyway, I'll see you back there. Right, well, I'm back at town. Let's go check out the notice board. So we had 11 blobs, and I took out quite a few blobs on that freaking bush thing. Let's see if that works. It's gone up to 12. So taking out the whole nest, the whole nest, gave me one point. So maybe I have to just destroy nests. It doesn't matter how big they are, because I'd much rather take out the small nests, if that's the case. So I need to go hunt a few more nests. OK, now one of the missions that I have right now is to give an opal to Wingari. Now, I've, um, yeah, I've been messaged by a couple of people to say this river up in this top sort of western northern region going along this river they said somewhere towards the south somewhere around here maybe in the crook of the river you're going to find an opal so it might be there or it might be there or it might be at any of the crooks basically they said i'm going to find up opals so i'm going to head west and i'm going to go there and work my way up the river and see if we can find an opal or two okay all right so west i'm actually heading west right now aren't i no, that's east, Steve. You need to go this way, I think. Right. I really wish we could put down some work custom waypoints, you know? But anyway, looks like I might have some swimming to do and all sorts of stuff. But I'll see you when I get close to this river, yeah? Okay, jumps. Well, we've arrived at said river. Let's um, glide over said river. Right, and let's see where we are on the map once I land here. See if I think I'm near to where they might have hinted at where we are. I think I'm a little far south, but that's okay. We can follow this river up and see if we can spot these opals. Now, if I do come across any sort of like small nests, I might try and take them on. So they did send me a picture of what these opals look like. They look like white jelly beans or something 
So, I kind of know what I've got to keep my eye peepers open for. Oh, balls, I'm actually in the withered. Well, that's, um... Well, that's a bit of a surprise. I thought I'd culled all the withered areas. Unless this big duck... Ah, it's because I'm right on the edge of the map. Okay, I'm going outside of bounds. Alright, now let's head up the river. Okay, I was going the wrong way. Oh dear, I'm losing lots of stamina being in the water, aren't I? Alright. Let's just climb out the river here a little bit. Because I think this could be a fairly close point to where there might be opals. Opals, opals, where are you? Yeah. I'll let you know when I come across an opal. Okay, chums, I have come across a withered nest. Now, I did say I would take these things on if I did come across them. So here we go. Let's give it a go. Out of it, spider of evil. Die, spider of evil. Die, spider of evil. Ah. Sa, sa. Right, okay, right. I think I've taken out enough spiders of evil. Let's take out this tumour. Take that tumour. I'm chow. Let's pick that up. Run around here. Take this one out. Before any spiders respawn. Yeah! Last one! Come me! Come Go on. And an no, no. extra bonus points if you know where that's from. Not that bonus points win you anything. Alright, well, we took out that. I'd teach it. Alright, back to the river. This is just up a little bit from the river. I saw that there was like a little alcove from the river and I thought I'll, I'll, I'll follow the alcove up and see if there's any opals up there. There wasn't any opals, so I guess we're just following the river a bit more then. I'll just double back on myself just in case I missed a, an opal. Ah, come on, climb, damn you, climb! OK, don't climb, just get wet then. Is that an opal right there? That looks like an opal! Yes, that's an opal. Right, OK, well, let's show you where this is on the map, then. I'm right there, on this sort of, like, little turquoisey bit where the river goes thin. So you've got these three stones head north of there, and you're there. Opal location. Um, why can't I harvest the goddamn thing? Now I can. Take that opal. That's what the opal looks like. Look, we've just got some sunlight come out for you. Isn't that lovely? All right. Probably use that as a thumb now, couldn't I? Yeah! Come on! You know you want to come out the ground. Come on! How many times do I have to whack this thing? There we go. We've got an opal. There's probably more dotted about, but that's what they look like. They're like little dots of snot, don't they? Okay, right. I've got to head all the way back to town now. Okay, well, I think it's just east then. Yeah. Right, I'll see you back at town. Oh, I spy with my little eye another nest of evil! Right, let's go take on the nest of evil. With my swashbuckling skills. Ah! Oh, God. My, um... My... It's about to break. I better craft another one. Fudge you, mate! I was freaking crafting a bloody sword! Yeah, yeah, take that! Yeah, you want some? Yeah, I knew it was going to break. Give me another one, then. I just crafted one and took frickin' damage. All right, let's just swap to that and then swap to that. Give me my frickin' sword. There we go. Ah, get out of it! Slashing at nothing! I find that happens quite a lot in this game, people. Because of the dodgy, wonky camera angles. I wish we could get given the lock on. You know, I wouldn't say this game is overly challenging when it comes to combat. The reason it's overly challenging is because the camera angles are overly challenging. When you're running away from things, you can't get the camera angle where you need it to be to actually watch their attacks. It's why I find those hands so hard. Because when you're running away from them, you can't see when they're going to do their pounce move. Gits. Yeah, there we go. Right, well, by my reckoning, I should be on 14 of 20 now. Because I've taken out two of the dang things. Don't you get given anything lovely and super and wonderful for doing that? No, just a bit of amity. What did I get? I think I got about 50 amity for that one. I think that's a medium-sized nest. Small nest, you only get like 30. Ah, 
the balls. I ran to get to the ledge. Oh, there we go. That's all right. I've got a little bit of a breather. Anyway, I'll see you back at base unless I come across another nest of evil. It's moments like this when you climb up to the top of a vista and, and you just look around in awe. This is freaking insane, isn't it? Look how beautiful this game actually is. Even in barren areas, it's freaking beautiful. I'm quite a way away from town, though. Ha ha ha! I've arrived back at town. I'm going to have you, little bush. Yes! Bush is mine. Right, let's head on over here, then. And I guess I can use my teleporter to get myself a little bit closer. But before I do that, I'm just going to check out that notice board. Have I gone up to 14 blobs? Done! I'm hoping so. Yes! We are! We're on 14, so that's what counts. It's just any nest. Take out any nest. All right. Fine. Okay. Right, well, we need to go and take this item that I picked up. These opals is lovely, lovely. Oh, I want to keep it. It's freaking gorgeous. Got to take it to Wingari, the Sky God. And I know where they were last. I just don't know whether they're still there now. They were up here in Mango Vale. Okay, so I've arrived located in Mango Vale. And I think what I need to do is go all the way up to the top of the Sky Temple area. And Wingari is at the top of the mountain. Or at least that's where they were the last time I was here. I wonder if hitting that gong makes the um, the whales, the sky whales, whatever they are, the... I can't remember their freaking name after doing all the missions anymore. Tambugas or something, I don't know. wonder if it makes them come back. Anyway, I've got to climb all the way up there. Yeah, I can see her feathers. She's still there. Let's do this. Now, it's, it's a fairly easy mountain to climb, but I go up that way. And then on this, I go to this potato-y type shaped one over here. Climb that one. You kind of have to plan your routes on mountains. I try to look for either hilly areas or little divots, like um, almost like it's honeycombed. Uh, and that sort of helps me get to where I need to be. Hello, Wingari. I've got you an opal, mate. Oh, it's you. Midsize greetings, timely human. Midsize greetings back to thee, O oh feathered one. What brings you to my temple? Are you merely here to behold my, me and my splendor? A gift from Hiluna. Ah, yeah, Shimu Shima. Sweet. There you go. Indulge in your opal. Look how it shimmers. Exactly, mate. You freaking love it, don't you? You love it. You freaking love it. Cool. Okay, cool. Um, no, that's... Okay, we'll go with that. Yes. Cool. I'm glad you do. There you are. Done. Are you going to take to the skies, little pigeon? No, you're not. Okay, all right, fine. Oh, look, there's another freaking nest down there. I'm going to vanquish said nest. I don't have any energy provisions, do I? Because I'm a little bit low on the health. Um, I don't think I've got anything I can munch on. I can I can eat some of this, I think. Oh, no, you can't. I thought you could eat alley leaf. All right, can I eat this cactus? I can. Oof, that's, that's, that's not going to be good when it comes out the other end, is it? Okay, right. Um, hopefully there was no prickles on it. Let's head on down. The only trouble with is head on down to battle this. I've got to climb all the way blinking back up again. These nests are getting quite difficult for me to spot, so I'm going to go and fight it. I'm going to take on another nest of evil with less than half energy. All right. Nest of evil, I have you in my sights. You will be mine. Oh, fudging heck. There's a bloody git bag down there. Look. Oh, no, I'm going to land on said git bag if I'm not careful. Okay, right. I'm hoping these spiders keep that big git bag away from me. And they didn't. Okay, right. This is what I mean by when you run, you can't see what's behind you. Look. See what I mean? Look at this thing. And it's going to kill me. I know it's going to kill me. Sod off, spider. Oh, my God. Could do about you as well. Freaking get! I've got a proper fight. I have that though. Come on then, get you and your janky animations. Yeah, I'll slap you in the head with my freaking bone. 
Yeah! Don't get freaking overconfident, Steve! This thing could kill you in a heartbeat! Okay, right, we've got him. Oh, we've got a claw! Those claws, I can make an iron sword with that. We're going to have to make an iron sword once we've got our time. After we've managed to get all these blobs done, I can actually start making iron ingots. You need to get rid of all... You need to get your town up to the next level so you can have a black smithery, so you can make your um, steel ingots. There we go. Take this, nest of evil. So yeah, I'm going to be hunting down these nests in each episode that I do, just like a sub-activity, I think. So as I'm doing quests, side quests, if I see any of these nests of evil, they're freaking done, mate. They're freaking done! Right, okay. Why have I got horrible music playing? Is there something else threatening in my life? Nope! Okay, right, I'll head back to a teleporter then. Something else I need to do is if I see any trees that I'm not 100% sure if I've cut one down. I have cut down a latex tree. I actually grew a latex tree. But I want to complete my Shemudex. Shemudex! And so if I see anything weird and I'm like, have I cut that down yet or not? I'm just going to hack them down and see if it adds to my Shemudex. Well, what's going on over here? Have I got to add another offering here or something? Oh, so I guess you can resummon the Jabanga. That's what they're called. Jabanga. Okay, fine. I've already got alley route. What about this thing? What the fudge is that? Dead forked tree. I think I've already had one of them too. I haven't had this. What the fudge is this? Okay, what am I going to get out of you? Oh, there we go. Added to Shemudex. It didn't give me anything new for digging that blinking thing up though, did it? Are you new as well? No, hey. Hey, y'all! I'm going to have to come back here and dig that thing up again and see if it gives me anything that I've never had before. Dang it, there's no others of those things that I've never had before. There's some flint there. You can just pick flint up off the ground, nice. Alright, anyway, I digress. Oh, would you look at that? There you go. Covered in geyser, habitats arid, provides fudging nothing! Well, that, that's worth having then, isn't it? All right, fine. Just break your spade on nothing. Now, someone did tell me that after you actually manage to fix up a shrine, some of these little vases you can actually open and get yourself trinkets from. So I'm just having a look to see if I can find said trinket inside of here. I don't know whether they're winding me up, people. Oh, here we go. Oh, look, I've got a decorative gate. They're right. So I need to go visit all my shrines, I guess, and... Oh, look at that. I got myself a lovely little gate. Nice. All right, well, they look like that, people. They're like weird vase things. I don't know whether there's just one here or whether there's multiples. I don't see any more, but they could be well hidden. But there we go. That's a nice little tip to be had, isn't it? Righto. Cool. Okay, we're back. Let's go and find the lady that gave us this quest and hand in the fact that I had gone and seen Wingaru, the Sky God, and made him happy. Or her. Hello. How are you? You've returned. Did the goddess Wingari enjoy the glimmering opal? She freaking loved it. I'm pleased to hear it. You've done me a great favour. Nice. Here's a token of my gratitude, young one. What the fudge did you give me? Oh, Greater Moon Jump Elixir. Well, thank you very much. Well, that, that should help. It makes me like a kangaroo. Frickin' lovely. All right, well, what have I got left then, left to do in my journal of things? I've got nothing. Nothing in my journal of things. However, on the old map, I do have that there, which says Agit is reborn, so we could go see him next time. And we've got this one down here that says the alchemy of love. Dada seems to have strong feelings for Hoyuk, which means what a hunk. Maybe I can help these two get together. So it looks like we've got some matchmaking to do and we've got to go see Ajit. So I guess we can go do those next episode, people, inside of the viewers. But then after that, I haven't got many other side missions to do. What I would say, though, is I do still have some orders to fill. And a lot of them is just turning in a shed load of dirt. Hold on, let me just uh, make myself a bit smaller again so you can see that. 
So there we go. I've got to get some kelp. I've got to get some dung. I've got to get some elastic fin for one place. I've got to do this one as well, which is crazy. I've got to get sea blight and coral and sea silk. We might have to go do some diving, which I haven't done much of. And we've got that one. Cob, kelp, alley leaf and latex. I could probably do that one. I just need a bit more kelp. Yeah, I could probably get that one done fairly easy, to be honest. And that one. I could get a load of mushrooms and I could get a load of dung. Not a problem there either. So there's a few I could do. Alright, so we've got a few bits and bobs I can do there. There is also, on here, the ecosystems that I still need to do. And again, it's getting the shed load of dung. Which is a bit mental. Yeah. Fun times. So a lot of picking up poo. A lot. I mean, there's a hundred. A hundred to get there. That's insane. Wow. And I've got to get a lot of amity. So there's still things to do in this game. Is it just busy work at this point? Yes. Yes, it is. Am I ready to do a review of this game? Yes. Yes, I am. So I'll probably do a review soon. Yeah. Anyway, people, I hope you're enjoying all of these. And if you are, sound off in the comments. Let me know you're enjoying them. And if you're playing it, if you've picked this game up, let me know as well. Till next time. Goodbye, goodbye. And goodbye again. Just